Bring back another video today and today's video like I mentioned in the last video So today's video is going to be a video of showing you guys and explaining to you guys of how what I want to do in my tackle room Like showing and explaining you what my thoughts and process are and seeing what your guys input is of what I th What you guys think should I do and shouldn't do in this tackle room and everything So let's just stop wasting time and just jump into today's video Let's kick it. Okay guys, so let's walk into the tackle room as you walk in You've got the door over there and I got box over there, and yeah. So, what my thoughts and plans are is actually taking this corner over here. So it's not that big of a corner. I'm moving all my rods and putting all my rods over here. Okay, this is a rod storage place. Like then have like I'm not sure what I'd put over here, but I have a few things over here. Take this entire back wall. So start from there and loop all the way around and come back up to there. So it's not a big space, it's like the same equivalent space to that. Like, it's not that big, as you guys can probably see. It's not big at all, like the camera does no just, doesn't even do any justice to it. It's tiny, so I could probably fit an entire workbench coming down here. And that, which I would like to do, and then like, or even what I would also do is like, to have a workbench from from like on this entire bar going around like that until the window to window type of thing then on this wall that wall and that wall is have like you know in the tackle shop how they set it up and they've got all the like soft plastics lures and everything hooked up like that we have that type of setup up along this entire wall over here um over here what i'm going to probably end up doing is or what i want to do is put a bookshelf up over here or a shelf put up some shelving and whatever and put like because i've got just those things over there at the moment. So like that thing over there is these those two for nothing inside of it. That one over there has just got random and so like miscellaneous items laying inside of there. So what I would like to do is like put a bookshelf over here. So put a shelf up here so like then to also create neatness in here. And put like and have all my other stuff in here. Like have my tackle boxes set up here and whatever. Or I could even just put up a table or something. And have tackle boxes and that stuff laying up over here. One of my other su ideas and suggestions of what I was thinking of doing is instead of putting the rods over there, was putting in like a table over there and put like all this tackle over there. But then I realized I don't have enough space and whatever to put them all there. Because uh, over here, this corner over here would be a nice place to put all my tackle, which I think I'm going to do. So I get a bookshelf, put a bookshelf up here. Okay, I have a place for my net, for my keep net, my landing net. Uh, I've got like rod buckets over here. I've got a bait, bait bucket, whatever, like for carpet when you put your mealies in that. I've got my rod bucket. Like all I need in this rod bucket, like I've got to clip on there. Then I need to get you know that other clip to to do this. Like I've having a chance. And this one over here is is what my friend actually found on the beach. But like she said, hey, try use this. So this might fit. This like all I need is this clip over here. If I can get it undone. I'm just doing it much here. Yeah, all I need is this clip over here and that. That's all I need. This one and that clip for that one there doesn't fit. So that's my problem. So I've got my landing net, my rods, put my put these rod stands or whole rod stands. I need to get myself some rod holders and everything. So I've got that. I've got a uh, container just full of reels. I've got my trace kit. My chase box of it, swivels, hooks, or like mainly just fill up with hooks, some shad, f uh, float things, whatever you call them. My brain's not even with it, and I've got my salt water tackle box. Like, so that everything there is still the same. I haven't really gone through that compartment and fiddle there so much. But in here, I've got like I used to have this tire thing full, that thing, that thing, that thing full, and this thing over here used to also be full with tackle it in here now. So I've taken all the tackle out there, I've put it into here because I've got the drawers and everything down there. I've got f like f f four like things like that almost that slide in. Then I've got like other things in there. So that's like completely salt water. But my bass tackle box I saw in the last video of a review of that. But a thing full of sinkers. I've got carp bait in the in that white ice cream container over there. Like your dips and corn and floaties. I've got line that over there's traces side of here. That's just that's just like off cuts of line and whatever. Try to keep things neat. 
And here I've got some carp traces and all my carp stuff in there. Like I say, in the last video, I need more tackle boxes. That's one thing I need is more tackle boxes. I don't have enough tackle boxes. Like I used to have all my bass gear as well as the carp stuff in there. But like, when I go out bass fishing, I'm going out bass fishing. Sure. Like sometimes I'll take a few small hooks with a policeman or barber in there. Sure. Just for fun. Or something. Whatever. But if I'm going bass fishing, I'm generally going bass fishing. Everything else in mine is there. So I need this thing over here to like kind of neaten up. What don't know what your guys' input of ideas of that is. I'm gonna put a table over there, rods over here, put a bookshelf over here, and find other things over here to put in here. So let me know down in the comments down below what you guys think of what I should do in here. Right, so Lucas Jeremy is my brother. Come into the proper light, please. Okay. So. So I've got my brother over here, my brother Sinjin, he's joining here, he's from last in a few videos ago or like in a few, like a few videos ago, him throwing stuff in the tree. Yeah, so that's my brother. What's your input of what I'm thinking of doing in the tackle room? Do you think it's gonna work well or do you think it's just gonna be a total mess? I think it's gonna work well. I didn't know what talking about. Yeah, you'll see in the video. Okay, so like he kind of knows what I'm meaning, but he also at the same time doesn't really know what's all going to happen, but let me know in the comments below if you think I should do it or not do it. I'm thinking I should do it. And yeah, do you want to end off this today's video or should I? Oh, don't forget to subscribe. And ring the notification bell and like this video. And as always, see you in the next video. Peace.